No, I mean, this, this team is very different to a lot of the teams that have played in the past. Um, so, you know, we don't inherit the wins, we don't inherit the losses. So, um, we, we know it's tough to tour here. In India are a really good cricket side, especially at home. So, uh, we're excited um, and, yeah, we'll give it our best shot. Yeah, I think it's more important here than anywhere else in the world, that first innings um, you know, lead, hopefully. Um, yeah, you just got to find a way to, to, to put a big total on the board, um, you know, especially thinking if it's going to spin, it's going to get really hard in that second innings. Uh, you know, for an Aussie team, I think it's it's got to be right up there. Um, purely the conditions are so different to what we grew up playing at home, um, if they spin, but... And yeah, that's really exciting. Um, you know, we've managed to win a couple of good tours away in, in foreign conditions in the last 12 months, and that's the exciting thing about travelling here. It's, um, you know, you don't get these opportunities all the time, so we know it's going to be challenging at times, but, yeah, we're, we're looking forward to embracing that and um, just enjoying it. Uh, yeah, we have. Uh, yeah, we, we announced the, um, the team at the tops tomorrow, but um, we're really confident in everyone in our touring party at the moment. Um, you know, Cameron Green's injured so he won't play but um, other than that um, and same with Josh Hayeswood but um, yeah we, we feel confident in everyone um, uh, yeah I think you know we're lucky that we did have those tours last year um, so you know, just about everyone has had some experience if not here in subcontinent um, everyone's played ODI cricket over here or um, you know or Aus- Australia Ray tours or um, you know, two of here quite a bit, so um, you know, that's what the last seven days have been, really good preparation, um, although we might not have played games, we're really accustomed to these conditions now. Oh, potentially, I think it yeah, looks a little bit dry for the left-handers, um, and, and knowing how much traffic will probably go through there from the right arm bowlers, um, yeah, potentially might be a, a fair bit of rough out there, so um, again, that's something yeah, we just got to embrace. It's going to be fun. It's going to be challenging at times, but um, you know uh, our batters relish relish the chance to problem solve on their feet, and um, I think quite a few of them will get that chance this week. Yeah, Nathan's going to be you know just right up there with our most important bowl for this series. You think um, he's going to bowl lots of overs? He's got experience here, so um, yeah, he's he's up for the challenge. He can't wait. Uh, he's been working with a lot of the other spin bowlers that are over here as well. So, um, yeah, he'll lead our attack this, this series. Uh, yeah, obviously, you know, disappointing that they're not available. Um, you know, hopefully both of them uh, come back online for, for the second test match. Um, but again, you know, having someone like Scotty Bowling in the squad who's played a lot for us over the last 12 months and performed well um, in all conditions, um, you know, and Lance Morris as well, kind of untried, but uh, we're really confident in his ability. So, um yeah, unfortunately, you know, Starkey and Joshy is kind of our front line. Two options aren't available, but we feel really, really um, happy with the, the depth that we have. Yeah, you, you've got to try and bat big in that first innings and, um, you know, it might not be the same amount for each venue. You know, it might be 250 is a good score or there might be other venues where you need to bat big and try and get 500. So, um, yeah, again, you know, you kind of look at the wicket, but it's hard to read until you actually start batting on it, so you just got to be ready for everything.